Hey guys, today is my, hey guys, today is my very first, um, mobile game upload, um, sorry for the kind of cruddy beginning, um, the app has a 3 2, 1 countdown, I thought I was going to start recording instantly, but there's a slight delay, so let's get into it, this is Jane Wild, um, it's a mobile game on Android, and I guess, uh, Apple. Let's see what I get. Ooh, five thousand. That's great. I didn't need ammo. Five hundred. Okay. So as you can see, um, I just picked play because we're gonna do um a walkthrough. So twelve thousand dollars, almost thirteen thousand. Um, I'm please just fill up. On that, and yeah, that's pretty much it. Hold on. Hmm. There you go. Okay. So I just upgraded my guns. Um, as you can see, we have a level six pistol, a level six shotgun, and a level four light machine gun. Um, we're actually gonna do the first level boss. Um, I mean first stage boss. Um, with the pistols, just because I'm pretty much strong. Sorry if there's a slight lag. Um, usually does this for a couple seconds and uh, corrects itself. Um, I shouldn't have no problem beating this. I'm just using the pistols. Um, let's see. Yeah, this is pretty much real easy. Um, oh, I took one hit. I didn't want to take that hit, but I did. I was standing just a little too close. Um, so this is basically what you do. You gotta get the one side level to the other. And you gotta kill zombies and everything. You don't have to kill all the zombies, but you do have to kill zombies. And uh, he's pretty much about to be dead. Yeah. And there's the end. Um. I'll let you guys read some of this story. Okay, so I just wanted you guys to read the story. Um, the beginning is about the, that dude that you seen wiping out the blood, him telling uh, Jane that there is um, zombies and uh, other things resurrecting from the grave. So she runs out there with him, and that's how it basically starts. You don't know who's behind it, but all you know is that they're doing it. Um, I'm gonna just play level four. I'm gonna just play the levels I haven't played. This way, you guys actually get to see something. Um. So as you can see, zombies drop uh, coins. They also drop uh, power ups, which is down here on the bottom of the screen. I don't want to tap on them because if I tap, it means I'm using them. Um. Ooh, almost took a hit there. Uh, the shoe allows me to reload and shoot faster. I just got an achievement. It also allows me to move faster, which is like one of the first power-ups you can buy for cheap. Really extremely good power-up. Um, nothing bad about it. Ooh, should get those coins. Um, 
And as you can see, my health bar is in red by the pause button. Below that is the time. I have a certain amount of time to beat each board to get a star for it. Um, usually, I'm not worried about the stars until I complete all of them. So once I complete everything, oh dang, I didn't see the dog. Um, I actually will show you guys a little bit of a Gatling gun after I use the shotgun a little bit. Um, right now it's looking pretty easy, but that's because I'm supposed to be on the swamp board with these kind of um, power ups and stuff. Now, as you can see, I was supposed to take less than 10% because the board was so short. And I was supposed to get through it in 70 seconds because this board was actually short. Um, To be honest, some of the boards are longer than others. Hold on one second. Okay, we're back. Um, Sorry, I had I just wanted to pause on it. I want you guys to see me uh, click out of there or anything. Um... I do want you guys to see the shot. I mean, uh, well, you see what the shotgun can do. I'm gonna play actually the fifth area. I mean, the boss area, it's boss stage. And um, play with the Gatling gun just so you guys can see. Um, basically, when you power these things up, like when you uh, upgrade them, they get different effects. Um, this one pretty much has like the best effects. Uh, the first two is while it's getting hot, it does more damage. So basically, while you're just sitting here shooting, it increases in damage, um, which is always a good one. Um, I just took that explosion to the face. So this is a pretty good gun. Um, right now, you can. I turn the gestures and stuff off, so you'll see when my uh my Gatling gun gets hot. Um, I just bought a power up, so the Gatling gun takes longer to heat heat up, and it does more damage. So, um, it's pretty easy once you get it up to a certain level. It's just walking <laughs> and mowing them down. The only thing is you can run out of ammo. As you can see up in my um, top right corner, it says I have 150 ammo left right next to my money. Um, basically while I'm playing through this, I'm using a strat that I use for most of these side scroller shooter games. Um, the strat is basically, uh, oh, gotcha. The strat is to only use like three guns. So play through one time, you know, build up a lot of money and find out what guns is like um, really good, like really, really good guns. And out of the, what is it, the five guns you get to pick on here, I think it is. Yeah, it's five guns because it's the pistols, the shotgun, the gatling gun, bow and arrow, and um, what's the other one, uh, grenade launcher. All of, all of those, the grenade launcher is pretty good, but you want to uh, have at least, oh, almost kidding. You want to have, um, just use your shot shoot faster. Um, you want to have the Gatling gun just because you know you're going to have to mow down enemies here and there. Okay. Um, the shotgun for that close range, and when you hit people with it, it backs them up. So it's a really it's a really good thing to have, especially like when they're trying to corner you from both sides. Um, but other than that, it's pretty much just uh, these three guns that you want to run. I mean, you have to run the pistols anyways, but you just want to run these three because um, you gonna get more ammo for these three guns instead of everything else. Okay, now you niggas is getting me. A little bit down on life. No worry. Health drops on this game pretty good. 
And I'm just using the pistols right now because I want to rebuild all my ammo up for my uh, other gun. Um, it's one clip away from being full. I'm actually gonna grab that. I'm gonna grab that shotgun ammo. Oh, no, no, no. Um, I'm taking my time just so the video is slightly old. Oh, my goodness. Hold on. He's a boss. Uh, he basically shoots these bombs in the air. The quickest way I found out how to beat him is to use the grenade launcher. But see, if I buy the grenade launcher, that means I'm not getting as much pistol or shotgun ammo. Let me pause one more time. It's freezing. Okay. So, um, I actually just purchased some ammo back. Didn't even really need to. Um,. Can't really upgrade anything uh, as you can see the bow paralyzes the enemies and slows them down so basically like when you hit them they're poison but it also like makes them stun for first couple like three seconds and they move even slower excuse me so that's good and a fish gun is basically a grenade launcher um it does work but um like I said, if you buy that, you're not getting as much ammo as you want for your shotgun and your pistols. Like, if I use all the ammo out of my Gatling gun, I'm pretty sure I'm going to be refilled on my shotgun and my um pistol. If I use all the ammo on my pistol, I'm probably sure I'm going to be stocked up on my shotgun or halfway stocked up on my Gatling gun. That's how you, you um, should play these certain type of games. Now, I know you want to get the best guns, but... When you do it this way, at least uh, you can upgrade your guns to the fullest potential. So you know they're going to be doing max damage and everything. And you know you're going to be staying in ammo for them. Um, there's really no reason to max out your uh, ammo. I just like to do it because I have the money. Um, here's some of the power-ups. Uh, this one makes you do triple damage. And if you run it with frenzy power, you basically like... There is no reload animation because she's able to uh, shoot mega fast and reload mega fast and also walk mega fast. So there's really no animation for you reloading. So it's just her shooting one bullet that does triple damage and my pistols are pretty strong. So and it works with shotguns and it works with the Gatling gun. Um, the only thing about the Gatling gun shooting very fast is that um, it gets stronger while it heats. But also, it's going to run out faster. Um, here's the iron. Um, iron armor. I think about getting that. It just protects you from hits for like 10 seconds or so. Which is actually pretty good. Um, divine intervention is pretty garbage. You just drop a stick of dynamite and it hits everybody on the screen. It might not actually kill anybody on the screen. Depending on how close they are. Uh, Stampede. If you hit it and it's a bunch of bulls that run across the screen. Um, pretty good. Doesn't kill everybody, but does good. Um, it's a skeleton deputy. This is okay. Um, basically what happens is you summon a skeleton, and he has pistols, and he um, basically will watch a bat. Like any zombies that come from behind, he'll help shoot or kill. Um, and any zombies that come from the front, he'll shoot too. He's, help, he's good for help taking out bosses because there's a lot of bullets flying at the boss. And sometimes certain boss, like, they get stunned if they get hit too many times. So that's why he's good. Um, And Sitting Bull, this one I haven't bought because it's a retarded amount of money. It's $25,000, but it basically wipes everybody off the screen. Um, The only ones I think I'm about buying is uh, these two. Um, the summon skeleton deputy in a uh, sitting bowl. So that's pretty much out. Um, I'll let you see the outfits. You had to pay money for the outfits. Except for this one. Um, the Iron Maiden. It gives you more health. 
uh to get it though you have to get 100 stars that's what i said i'm gonna beat all i'm gonna once i beat everything i'm gonna go back and try to um make sure i get all the stars um as you can see i'm on the swamp board and this has um my brother is playing the same game as me so um he's he's, he's up there i think he's on the fourth stage um i think he said fifth and ten got uh boss battles like they're two separate like it's a boss stage on the fifth level and it's a boss stage on the 10th and he said um once you get past the fifth they start throwing in a bunch of like miniature bosses on eight seven and nine so that's pretty good all right so uh thank you guys for watching my first mobile game upload